Oh my God, Tommy. I forgot to tell you he was coming home. Oh, thanks for your letters. They really kept me going. I was looking for you three months ago. Yeah, I got a little fight in the yard. They threw me back in, so. Yeah, well, let's not screw up your early release, okay? My little brother is a screw up, Mora. A completely lovable screw up felon. Boy, he's in the shower, Dr. Riles. What's this look like to you? Ah, it's pretty sad. It's a poor fellow on our coaching staff slipped and fell in the shower this morning. Team's pretty shook up about it. My coaching staff is awful. Yeah. Hey, listen, while you go out and enjoy the game, I'll walk her through this and I'll have her out by the bottom of the first. Oh, it's okay with you. I'm gonna uh, wait here for Dr. Riles, all right? Yeah, all right, sure. Let me, uh, let me go check on her, all right? I'm Jesse Wade. Detective Jane Rizzoli. And I know who you are. Uh, rookie of the year when you came into the bigs, two-time All-Star. Impressive. I'm a big Red Sox fan, but, you know, maybe you guys can confirm me. Yeah, maybe. <sighs> what is it? Radiating circular skull fracture consistent with a hard impact. And this, a second compression fracture to the occiput. He slipped, cracked his head on the shower handle, hit the floor. I'm declaring the manner of this death suspicious, pending further investigation. Well, I said that you hired McKenna as a special assignment coach. He was Manny Vegas' sober coach. You had a sober coach for your star player? It's no secret Manny has had issues. So I brought in Ron, right before my asshole ex-husband locked me out. Oh, I hope. Up there, you see that? Directional blood spatter. Smells like bleach. Somebody cleaned up a murder. Wow. Did you miss your lucky bat today? We had to borrow it. Ron McKenna's blood's all over your bat, Vega. How'd it get there? I'm not talking to you guys. Call my lawyers. Did Ron bust you for drinking? Maybe that's why you killed him. I didn't kill nobody. Um, tell me about Vega. You guys have been teammates for what, two seasons. Man, you get right into it. Yep. Just acting crazy, except when he takes the bat. Well, do you think he killed Ron McKenna? Ron came to me the day before he died. Wanted my help staging an intervention for Manny. Vega's drug test came back clean. When you're the face on the billboard, the name on the sports string. Your pee has a tendency to come back drug free, okay. Where'd you get the money to buy the dinner and drinks for the townie? Did you pawn Mora's stuff? Huh? Mora's house was burglarized. Her TV, her jewelry. Her trust. She trusted you. What do you think I did? Did you? It's Detective Rizzoli, Officer Rizzoli, and Tommy the Screw-Up. We have a breaking story. Manny Mega Vega, the Pilgrim's hey, home run station, up, has been killed in an automobile accident. No. Glucose, water, B vitamins, taurine, ginseng, caffeine. No drugs, alcohol, or steroids. No. His kidneys are damaged. Look at that crystallization. Yeah. From what? Ethylene glycol ingestion. Antifreeze. Someone was poisoning him. This is definitely the source of the ethylene glycol. So a killer was spiking Vega's special game bottle. Poor Ron McKenna. He suspects Vega's drinking, decides to check his locker after the game. Catches the murderer red-handed. Killer grabs Vega's bat, whacks McKenna in the head, drags him to the showers. Caught the burglars. Well, I got all our stuff back. Well, that's too bad, because I was really looking forward to three square meals a day and a clean jumpsuit. Go home. I don't have a home. Yes, you do. Mara said that you can stay as long as you need to. Ma wants you there. Mara wants you there. Jesse. Hey. You wanted to be a superstar. You wanted what Vega had. Face on a billboard, name on a sports drink. I worked for this. Everything was handed to him. He drank and drugged, and they just kept giving him more. Turn around, Jesse. You're under arrest for the murders of Manny Vega and Ron McKenna. 